So if you're looking at the screen, we get this point one. So point one, if you think about the enthalpy diagram or the pH log diagram, and I'm going to call it the log diagram going forward, is that you have that the, the first step is going from your suction to your discharge. So you have that low pressure CO2 uh, vapor going into a high pressure CO2 vapor. So in this example here, we're at about say 400 PSI, probably 35 bar ish. And you're going into that transcritical mode. So you're in the middle of summer, it's 45 Celsius, 110 degrees Fahrenheit out. And all of a sudden, you're going right into critical above the critical point. So this is where this point one is above, it's on the discharge side. This is the high stage compression discharge. This is where that refrigerant has been compressed and it's out of the discharge valve. And now it's at the highest temperature and highest pressure in the system. And then from there, depending on the ambient conditions will depend on what that pressure is. So you could be in a range of 1400 PSI, 100 bar, depending what the ambient temperature is outside. 